right guys, we are just going to jump right into this. I was going to do an intro, but no intro needed for Costco, right? So we have got stuff all over the place. So we'll start over here. I have um, <clears throat> the prices on here as well, except for this one. I didn't, <laughs> but I think this was $27.99. I couldn't find it on the receipt, honestly. They have things named weird things, but I think this one was $27.99. Sorry, Ralph. And then um, I decided to get this huge pork loin, boneless vacuum packed. This is humongous. It is nine pounds, $1.99 a pound. So it came out to $18.57. And I was gonna get like this two pack of uh, pork tenderloin that was like 15 bucks, but this was like so much more for bang for your buck. So I'm gonna prep this and stick a bunch of it in the freezer, but we can cook it as well. So this is gonna last us a lot a long time all of this stuff is gonna last us a long time because it's just the two of us but since we rarely get out to costco because it's about an hour drive for us to get there and so you'll see we doubled up on some things because we were like you know what we might not be back for a little while so um i did get that new salmon cookbook so i'm going to be making some salmon plus i am addicted to the salmon air fryer bites that i've been making so i wanted to make sure i had plenty of that um, how much was this? $1.79 a pound. No, I'm sorry. $9.99 a pound. Boy, that would have been a great deal. $9.99 a pound and it's almost two pounds. So $17.88. So I'm excited about that. Um, <clears throat> one of Andy's favorites is the loin, beef loin, New York strip steak, but they're thinly sliced. This was a little bit more of a splurge, but it's something that he really loves and he eats so little right now. So we definitely wanted to uh, make sure we had plenty of this he really loves this 10.99 a pound um and then this one was like three almost three and a half pounds and then this one was a little over three and a half pounds but they look i mean for him it looks i was looking at this like i look like bait for when i purchased bacon i wanted to make sure it looked uniform and neat and i thought both of these did so there's that we also doubled up on the pork belly because that is something that we both will eat um, I'll only eat it one certain way though when I make it into like a little snack, a crunchy snack. But this was $4.49 a pound and this package was, I can't tell, is that a five or a six? I think it's 5.81 pounds. So that one was about $26. And there's a lot in here. It's, it's like doubled up as you can see. There's like, see one, two, it's like two layers of it. So you're getting a lot in here. Oh, and then this one was, it's upside down, but just over six pounds. So this stuff is gonna last us. And here's another thing, we don't really splurge on a lot of things. We don't go out to eat or anything. Well, I do more than Andy, like I'll grab, you know, um, Jersey Mike's or a public sub in a tub kind of thing. But um, we love scallops. And I've always wanted to get like the big, large scallops and just really, I don't know, splurge on it. And we did, this is two and a half pounds and it was $24 a pound. So we did, we splurged on that and I can't wait to saute those in some butter. Next, we got some sparkling water and I don't think we've mentioned it to you guys, but Andy has actually started to drink some sparkling water just to have something different. So we got the 35 pack of the Kirkland for $10.99. And the Kirkland bath tissue, we love this. Well, I mean, we, it's toilet paper, but this i really like it it just seems to last forever 19.99 that went up i think it was 18 something last time <clears throat> and same with the paper towels i love the selecta size ones and these are humongous rolls they are huge and this lasts us a long time so 19.89 for those i think those went up about a dollar too next we're getting into some more food i got this last time and i really loved this it's smoked salmon there's a pepper, a traditional, and a dill, and it is $12.99 for this. And how much meat is it? It's a pretty good 12 ounces. And usually for me, I only need a few bites of this at a time. It's really delicious. Um, I just got the basic cheapest eggs um, with everything else that we spent. Um, $5.39 for 24 eggs. I also got some sauerkraut this one i've seen is a very good brand and it was normally 9.59 dollars 
but they had $2 off at the register. So it was $7.59. This is a raw organic sauerkraut. Um, I've seen Bobby from Flav City recommends this one. Um, but I'm planning on making the uh, Reuben sandwich casserole soon because I've just been craving it. And I thought, might as well get that while I was there. The Teton brand sausages are, Polish sausages are on sale right now. I don't know for how long. This is 100% grass-fed beef. There's eight in a pack. They're normally $17.39 and I still would buy two to three packs of these, but they had $4.40 off at the register. So it was like, I'm getting like $12.99 or something, which is a really good deal. I was really bummed though, because the last time I went, they had the little tiny miniature ones and I loved wrapping bacon around those and sticking them in the air fryer, but I did not see those this time, so I was a little bit bummed. As you guys know, we are getting over a sickness, so we're wanting to make sure we have plenty of Lysol and stuff. We're going to be doing a good spring cleaning over and above what Andy's already done. But this three-pack of Lysol, which is a pretty good size, these are like big, tall, not like <clears throat> small ones. These are pretty large. That was 15 $15.99. That stuff's expensive right now, so I'm I'm okay with that. I don't think that was a bad deal at all. Um, these, if you have never purchased these at Costco, run, don't walk. These are the best. $13.99 for this organic chicken sausage. Fully cooked already. They taste like regular sausages, and their ingredients are that. It's just organic chicken, water, sea salt, spices, lemon peel powder. That's it. And they are zero carbs. I'm telling you, these are delicious. So good. I haven't had them in a while either. Did get the detergent. Um, this is a really good one too. I think Bobby from Flave City once said it was really good and it's actually pretty affordable. This is like 225 loads if you, you know, use this, the amount they recommend but it's just got no dyes, anything like that. I can have some sensitive skin sometimes, so I like it. $16.89, this did go up. It was in the, I think it was like $15.99 last time. I got the Kirkland brand of the grass-fed butter. Sorry, it's like blurry. Um, this is $10.99 per package. There's four eight ounce blocks in here. So I got two of those. I got some of the healthy noodles. Um, I did get this before, um, but I don't think they had it the last time I was there. There's six packages in here. They're pretty darn good noodles. And as you can see, they're sugar-free, fat-free, gluten-free, cholesterol-free, dairy-free. So if you're doing dairy-free, that's nice. But it was $17.59. And again, this stuff is going to last us forever because Andy's not eating a lot. He's only eating meat. I don't tend to eat a whole heck of a lot either, so... I'm pretty excited. This is going to last us a while. Um, the shark cheddar cheese, this is a two pound block. I don't think this is the best deal, but since I was there, I got it. It used to be $5.99. It's now $6.49. I also got this variety pack of sliced cheeses. Um, <clears throat> I love all of these, but I got the Swiss too, because I'm going to be making that Reuben sandwich casserole. It was $6.99 for this. I think that was decent. I don't know why my camera is so blurry. It is um, six or it's two pounds also. So that's good. Um, I did get Kirkland brands of cream cheese. They did not have any other brand. They didn't have like a Philadelphia one. It's $7.99 for eight or six. Six eight ounce bars. I just can't read very well today. This one, um, Philadelphia cream cheese is going to be a lower carb count, but I'm okay with it. It's not the end of the world two carbs per serving in that one. Their bacon, great deal. I recommend getting the bacon there. I don't know why this is so blurry. Let me see if I can, oh, that's better. Okay, I don't know what I did, but um, four pack, four one pound packs of bacon and it's $11.99 each. So three, six, nine, twelve, three dollars a pound of bacon. That is a great deal. That is less than Aldi. So I probably should have doubled up on that because Aldi's is only like $4.19. So really good deal. I'm happy with that. I got four of their half and half. Good deal. $2.19 for that. I think it's like $2.65 at Aldi right now. So definitely was worth it. Tried something new for Andy. These are Archer 
Let's see, country, as we see, he got into it already. Country Archer Provisions, grass-fed beef sticks, minis, zero sugar, four grams of protein per stick, and the ingredients look really good. Grass-fed beef is the first uh, ingredient, which is that's what you want in a meat stick, right? And then a bunch of seasonings and stuff. So really happy with that. He had one on the way home to try, and he said he really liked it, so that's good. Also got some pepperonis. This comes in a two pack, so it's a pound for each one. You can cut this in the middle and then put one of them in the freezer. It, it handles very well in the freezer, so no issues there. Um, there we go with the blurriness again. But that was $10.99 for that, so that was a good deal. And then we did get a bunch of wipes too. Um, this is a four pack, 380 wipes for $13.99. We did the Lysol. Uh, you got more bang for your buck than the Clorox ones. And it comes, let's see, there's some different flavors. It looks like lemon and regular. Um, I did get a couple pieces of clothing. This was a, sh it's like a, a blouse. Um, let me see if I can show you the picture. That's what it's supposed to look like. It looks nice. I got a size medium, but I actually have to go into the office one day this week. Can you believe that? And I don't have any like nice blouses. I'm allowed to wear jeans, but I thought that would be nice for it. And then I got some of these linen. This shirt was $9.99, by the way. $12.99 minus a $3 at the register, which I thought was good. And then just like some linen shorts. I tr I'm trying a size medium to see if those work. And those were $9.99 also. Not a bad deal. And then chicken thighs we did get. It's always good to have that in there. That is $1.49 per pound, bringing it to like $13.75, so great deal there. And then <clears throat> $3.99 for their 40 pack of water, which is a really good deal also. So, man, I'm exhausted. Oh, there's one more thing. <laughs> one more thing is, Ralphie got into the chicken. Ralphie. Rotisserie Ralphie. chicken, just kidding. Dear. Andy hadn't eaten yet, so we got home. And he has enjoyed some of the rotisserie chicken, $4.99 for that. That price hasn't changed. I did stop. Oh my gosh, make sure you check out. I've got, I think I've made a reel, hopefully, for this or a short. But there was um, a Jimmy John's near the Costco, and Andy took me over there, and it was delicious. I got an unwitch. So, yeah, that is everything that we got, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that this was helpful to you. I hope that you, you know, were able, I hope the prices helped too. Let me know. What do you think the best thing that I got was? And make sure you stay tuned. Tomorrow, Sunday, I'm going to be kind of meal prepping and food prepping for the week. So I'll show you how I'm going to get all this in my freezer and get it prepared for the week to, you know, set us up for success. So again, thank you so much. Make sure you hit the like button, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. We really appreciate you guys. Have a great rest of the weekend. Bye.